Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to Gerbil Sims. I am the Gerbs, and we are in FS22, Farm Sim 22. Um... We had a minor glitch with recording. So these are already, oh jeez, these are already up, and I've already picked up the uh, water buffalo and filled it up at the river once. So I figure if I dump half of it in each of these things, it would be really nice to just be able to pull up to that one. But because we can't grind stumps yet, that is not a thing. Really? Which one is that going into? That's not very close. Alright, stop. Shut it off. Is that going into the one we're backing up to? Or the other one? Come on, open. Alright, we got water. Uh... Do, 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 that's on. Tomatoes storing. Activate. That's the button we're looking for. And it should be making tomatoes. Cost per hour zero. Really? Okay. Hey, we got tomatoes. Outstanding. Now, we can drive over to the other one. Uh, we drive into the other one. Dump the rest of our water. No. It will not dump out water without running. That's... Apparently gravity doesn't work without the engine running. We open this one up. How much? Eh. Get another trailer load of piece into these things. We'll be good to go. Lettuce. Okay, that one's on tomato. This one's on lettuce. Activate. They should both be storing. Yep. You've got a choice between change output mode storing selling or distributing I'm not sure what just if you have the game sell it for you you lose out on a bunch of money so you never want that activate okay this one's running no just lettuce Turn off, turn off tomatoes. Deactivate tomatoes. Okay. That's, that's what we want. That's running, and that's running. Now, we shouldn't be having as much problems with close those oversaturating what we're selling and not making as much we do need to run back and get more water though at least another two times which is quite simple it's just run down to the river back this thing up the uh there is a you can get water actually you know what Dum -da -dum -da -dum. Miscellaneous. The well is like three grand, but I have a fire thing. Pallets. 
Miscellaneous. Miscellaneous. I don't see it. I find it difficult to believe that it would be in there. Yeah, there's no way it's going to be in that stuff. Hmm. None of the stuff on sale is useful to me yet. Winter equipment, belt, header, trailers, dollies. You know, by the time I even find this thing, I could have made it to the river and back. Forestry animals? Not that you know what. Construction. Silo extensions. Supplementary. Silos. Container. It's a thousand bucks for the water hydrant. We have a thousand ninety three. Uh, water station can supply your water tanks with fresh water. However, if it charges us for water, we're going to end up going down to the lake anyways. And we have to pay our taxes today as well. On everything being super saturated. So with any luck, we get a couple of pallets from the greenhouses to fix that problem today. Although trying to get it out of it in one day might be asking a little much. Trying to get anything out of it in one day. I know they're faster than planting crops, but that might be asking a lot. Alright. It seems like the hill is less rocky on the other side here. Not sure why that's wiggling so darn much. Although it's kind of rocky on both sides next to the bridge. That's... Well, that would have been alright there. Can I drive through this? Yep. Rocky. Now we gotta not hit trees. Alright, we can go right beside this one. It's a little dangerous filling up at the river. If I back up too much, then I gotta move everything back to the uh, starting point. Because even super strength will not pull. You can't get a tractor out of the river with super strength. Come on, you can do this. I believe in ya. You got the horse powers. Set the cruise control and just aim in the right direction. Twenty seven's nice, considering we've been going one to two miles an hour in this thing for the last couple episodes. could technically take a day off from selling things 
just let the prices go back to normal. But on the other hand, we have taxes. On the other hand, she wears a golden band. Actually, that's I wear a gold band in that. Anywho. Since we were so far away from that thing, I wonder if we can just drive right up to it. point that we can probably start mowing this grass again but it's not quite as tall as it could be so we won't get as much out of it we gotta think that we're also paying for fuel yep we can so I guess that's not too bad go fill this up one last time And I almost want to say we should be done for the day. Because we're oversaturating everything we're selling. It's too bad we don't have any other little lakes on this map. Huh? Four liters of tomato already. Yeah, no. Just the river and rocks. Oh, the other hand, I wear a golden band. So, on average, we don't want to go into the negative. But we'll pull right back out of it. Because, like, we were oversaturating that stuff so much. Had I gone a couple more days of selling grass and wood, we'd have started going backwards, even with doing that. So apparently, I waited too long to uh, put these in. I really wanted to make them all nice and pretty with getting the stumps out of the way. Oh, there's a nice spot. Well, no, there. Yeah, there's kind of a nice spot over there. Oh, there's a nice spot over here, too. I don't even have to come across. See, it's not that I don't know how to back up a trailer. It's that I am pretty sure backing up that other kind of trailer is impossible. If anyone knows how to do that, I would love to know your secrets. I've come to the conclusion that if it's got a drive axle in front and you're hooked to that one instead of there just being the one axle, you're not going to get any steering done. One of these days I should try and pull out of that without loading it up with water first to see just how much of a difference 
that amount of water makes. Let's see. Well, the needles move, but you can't see what's going on there because the steering wheel's in the way. Gas gauge doesn't look like it works. It's showing about half a tank, and I got way more than that. What is it? Oh, yeah! Got a little bit of a cab around us. Oh, tree. Those mirrors don't do much good when all I can see is cab. Well, the bars, that would be the cab. Our roll cage. She's starting to get dirty. We gotta fill up the other one. Technically, we can cut some grass, but I don't. I'm not sure that we should sell anymore. Although, even at the saturated price of 500. Two loads of grass would pay our taxes today, which would keep us out of the negative. <laughs> that took a lot of water. There is a huge difference here now. Dang it. Well. Wonder if I can, I can probably smooth that once I get some cash. Cause this is now messed up, but oh well. We only need, what, a thousand liters of this stuff? To be able to sell one, we have seven. Yeah, it's quite possible we're not selling any today. Waited too long for these. What do chicken coops run? Construction, animals, although we have to feed them. No, nope, not cow pasture. Check it. Six grand. 79, 79, 139. Six grand. That's a big jump up. Six grand to 79 without something in the middle. And the cows have, they start at 75. Yeesh, 500. Is that the, um, yeah, that's the auto feed one. Million dollars. The feeding robot. So that's, that's the same thing, it just doesn't have them outside at all. Cub on large. It's worth an extra $200,000 to have that robot. Alright, enough of that. <sighs> we could either cut more grass. I've got half a thing there. I set this up to stop this. And I went uphill and let it go. And it got enough speed by the time it got here. That it plowed right through it and I had to set it up again. Got all sorts of different grass heights.
we go further back in. We can, wow. We got lots of smooth area to cut. And that might actually get us where we need to be.